Tonight, we're taking another look at one of the oldest establishments in our community. Andy Ani stopped by Peacock Alley to learn all about its history. Peacock Alley is not only the oldest restaurant in Bismarck, but in the state of North Dakota. I spoke to the owner, who tells me it has quite a bit of history. It's more than a restaurant, and it's definitely more than a bar. It's, it's, it's a big part of our community. Peacock Alley is in the historic Patterson Building in the downtown area and has been in business since 1933. One woman who's worked there for more than 15 years says there's nothing quite like it. I, I absolutely love it. There's people that, you know, we get people from all over and they hear so much about the Patterson Hotel and, you know, to be able to say that I've worked in a place that the restaurant's 100 years old and to be a part of that is phenomenal. Dale Zimmerman, the owner, says since he bought the restaurant 11 years ago, He's been doing everything he can to preserve what it means to so many people. We're never really the owners of the Peacock Alley. We're more like the stewards of the Peacock Alley. If you look at the woodwork in the restaurant and the mirrors, those are all original. Um, a lot of the mirrors have, you know, age marks on them. Uh, we distinguish our history, things, notable things that have happened in this location over the years. Like we have an area where four U.S. presidents have been in this building. Movie stars senators and even u.s presidents have dined in the peacock zimmerman says it even had a role in the prohibition era the western part of the state being german heritage really wanted alcohol the eastern part of the state being scandinavian didn't so there was a lot of places in downtown bismarck where legal or alcohol was served illegally and this building was one of them if you're from bismarck you might have even heard rumors that there are tunnels below the restaurant there is rumors. We have no evidence that it's true. <laughs> you haven't done any poking around? We have done lots, yes. Um, when they redid Main Avenue in uh, 2001, we were hoping that we'd be able to find some remnants of tunnels and stuff downstairs, but there wasn't any. Um, in the basement of this building, there is a door that you open it up, and it's a concrete wall. So it kind of makes you wonder, like, why would there a door be, be here? But we have no evidence. When people from all over the world come to Bismarck, Peacock Alley is one of their first stops. Zimmerman says they plan to keep its story alive and carry on its legacy for future generations. And if you're wondering, will there ever be more than one Peacock Alley? The owner says no, because you can't beat the original. Reporting in Bismarck for KX News, I'm Andy Ani. While the restaurant maintains its historic charm, they still keep up with the changing times. They have a state-of-the-art multimedia system in the Langer Room, named after former North Dakota Governor Bill Langer. Tonight at 9.